Uh, so I'm going to show you how to move your old contacts to your new location, your new phone. And the situation here, for example, is I've set up my new phone, I've put the SIM card in my new phone, and I've put the SD card, if there is even an SD card in my new phone. So I don't really want to touch my new phone anymore or move the SD cards back and forth. But my old contacts are still stuck on my old phone. So what I want to do here is... Um, move the contacts without using an SD card or without uh, using a computer. So here's what I'm going to do is keep in mind that your your phone without the SIM card is simply a tablet. So via Wi-Fi what I'm going to do is uh, go into my contacts, click on the menu, and I'm going to select import export here and I'm going to export to storage and the storage I'm exporting to is actually the internal phone storage so when I click on export to storage I'm going to select all and I'm going to click OK and you'll see what it says here your contact list will be exported to a file and uh, your phone might be different but it's going to be the same uh, steps or the same concepts so what I'm going to do here is uh, export to this file, and it's going to be a file with VCF extension, which stands for Virtual Contact File, and I'm going to click OK. Now all of my contacts, if I selected all of them, uh, which I did in the previous menu, would be in that one file. So once I have it in that one file, I'm going to actually email it to myself. So when I email it to myself, I am going to go to attach file in my email. So you see it's attach file. And I'm going to search for it in file manager or whatever your uh, app is for the file management. You'll see I have the phone storage. I'm going to select phone storage. And I'm going to scroll down to where I actually saved my file. You'll see I have three different VCF files. I'm going to select my most recent one. And basically your work is really done because what you're going to do is send it to yourself uh, via Gmail or Hotmail or whatever uh, mail that you have. And keep in mind again that your phone is simply a tablet without the SIM card. So I'm now going to go to my new phone. And when I go to my new phone, I'm simply going to pull up my email. And I, I could do this in one of two ways. If I read my email and I double tap on the attachment, it'll prompt me to import the contacts. Or I could ex ex uh, download that file onto my new phone and do the import in the contacts and search for it manually. But usually what I find is you check your mail on your new phone, you double tap on that file, it'll read the extension and know what type of file it is and then it'll prompt you to import the contacts. So that's how you move your contacts from your old phone to your new phone without having to actually move any uh, SD cards around and some phones don't even have SD cards to begin with so uh, that's not even an option so uh, but this is an easy way and uh, it's a way where you don't even have to touch your new phone after you've set it up and you've realized oops I still have uh, the old contacts in my old phone so I hope this helps you and uh, thank you for watching.